today so today i have come back with a piece 10 things time has taught me so the first one most of your life is spent chasing false goals and worshiping false idols the day you realize that is the day you really start to live and that's important do not chase false goals realize it today and start living it today life is very short the second you really truly cannot please all pe- all the people all of the time please yourself first and your loved one second everyone else is busy pleasing themselves anyway trust me trust me on that i ha- i had this problem as well throughout my adult years i had this problem of like I used to think that people should like me but now I don't do anything wrong but if they don't like me or if some of them don't like me it's absolutely fine it's their problem not mine third fighting the aging process is like trying to catch the wind go with it enjoy it your body is changing but it always has been don't waste ta- time trying to reverse that instead change your mindset to see the beauty in you nobody gets younger and you are as young as your heart is so don't try to fight that aging process fourth nobody is perfect and nobody is truly happy with their lot when that sinks in you are free of comparison and free of judgment and it is truly liberating you are not perfect i am not perfect but we need to find out the perfection in our imperfections don't compare don't judge just live your life fifth no one really sees what you do right everyone sees what you do wrong you do 10 right things no one will notice one wrong thing they all will come after you and when that becomes clear to you you will start doing things for the right reason and you will start having so much more fun and that's important <clears throat> sixth you will regret the years you spent berating your looks the sooner you can make peace with the vessel your soul lives in which is your body it's better your body is amazing and important but it does not define you your soul your heart is what is the main thing those are the things which define you as a person seventh your health is obviously important but stress fear and worry are far more damaging than any delicious food or drink you may deny yourself happiness and peace are the best medicine i'm not saying that you should eat are uh, closing your eyes but please please do not stress fear or worry eat what you want to eat control yourself but eat what you want to eat be happy eight who will remember you and for what becomes important factors as you age your love and your wisdom will live on far longer than any other material thing you can pass down tell your stories they can travel farther than you can imagine so no material things are important they will remember you once you are gone for what you have done for them ninth we are not here for long but if you are living against the wind it can feel like a life sentence so go with the flow life should not feel like a chore it should feel like an adventure and many people uh they forget to live they just carry on with their you know daily routine they stress they fear they become anxious about the future for them it feels like it's a life sentence but it's not it's an adventure enjoy it and finally and lastly always always drink the good champagne and use the things you keep for the best I'm not asking you to get drunk. What I'm trying to say here is tomorrow is guaranteed to no one. Today is a gift, that's why we call it the present. 
eat drink and be merry do not save your things for your best occasion it might not come when we sleep today tomorrow we might not even wake up so use it today today is the present you should live in today that's it for today those were 10 things time has taught me thank you dona ashworth um it's from to the women thank you very much for listening to me if you like my videos do watch and like my other videos too thank you very much namaste